And not all Republicans are on board with the new plan being presented by President Trump. That plan includes cuts to Medicaid. And News Channel 15's Sarah Schaefer is here with what our local leaders have to say about it. Well, it's been a common opinion during the overhaul of the Affordable Care Act. Cutting funding to Medicaid isn't something a lot of legislators agree with. Our governor, Eric Holcomb, is the latest lawmaker to say the same. The Affordable Care Act, or Obamacare, continues to be a popular discussion in Washington. Under the proposal of the Republicans, the number of people uninsured will not only grow to where it was before the Affordable Care Act, it will be more people uninsured. According to a report from the Congressional Budget Office, 14 million people would lose their coverage next year if Trump's American Health Care Act passes. A huge portion of savings within that includes cutting Medicaid, something Republicans nationwide aren't supporting. Reporting. Governor Eric Holcomb's press secretary sent me this statement saying, quote, the governor supports fixing the ACA, but he wants to make sure we're compassionate about how that's accomplished. That said, he understands this is just the first step in a long process. He and his team are working with members of the congressional delegation every day to find the best path forward. I also wanted to hear from our local representatives. Although city council doesn't have anything to do with this, sometimes local government is as close as people get to their lawmakers. We hear from these folks and sometimes they contact us about issues that we really don't have control over but they know who we are. We're their neighbors. We live in the community. We represent them. We see them out at the grocery stores and at the gas stations and they can come up to us and say, look Jeff, can you help us? Holcomb's press secretary also said Indiana's partners at the federal level know HIP 2.0 is a successful model with potential. Now on to looking ahead while considering what works. Something can always be improved, but we want to make sure whatever comes out of Washington is not a plan that covers less people uh, and that puts people in danger of not having health care. Sarah Schaefer, News Channel 15.